Anil Kumar and in this video we'll discuss cost markup and selling price relations as you know cost plus markup which we can write with M is equal to selling price S in any business they need to make some profit they buy an item at a particular cost increase the price and that sell it now that increased price is the markup so that's the relation you can always rearrange this equation to find markup m as equal to selling price minus cost right selling price minus cost at times we may be interested to find percent markup rate now markup is normally based on cost price remember that let me write it in a different ink. Markup is always based on cost price. So let me say markup is normally based on cost price. So if it is not defined in the question, then you have to assume that markup is based on cost price and therefore markup rate will be amount marked up m divided by the cost price times 100 so that gives you percent markup rate right so these are basic things which we need to know to solve questions based on markup now let's take an example let us say that cost of an item is 16 dollars so 16 dollars is let us say the cost And let's say the selling price is, let's say $24, is $24. Now the question is, we need to find what is markup. Now as you know, cost price plus markup is equals to selling price so that is the relation which relates them and we are going to use this relation to find our answer so i'll use a table kind of like this in coming up videos so let me kind of introduce you to this table right here so i'm writing a drawing a line here to show the relation cost plus markup is the selling price now in this question we know the cost is 16 dollars selling price is 24 dollars so how much is markup well clearly markup is difference between selling and cost price and therefore we can find this as 24 minus 16 and that is 8 so the markup should be 8 dollars right so that is one type of questions we can find markup if we know cost and selling price now we could have another kind of question which is to find percent markup so let us say the question is uh, find percent markup right so as we discussed earlier percent markup is based on cost price so normally it will be written percent markup on cost price so in our case markup is eight dollars cost price is sixteen dollars right so so the percent markup will be equals to 8 the markup price 8 divided by the cost price of 16 times 100 and that is equal to half times 100 you can use the calculator 50 percent right so in this particular case percent markup is 50 percent right remember this person markup is always based on cost price let me write c here so whenever you're saying cost price based on cost price 50 percent of cost price 50 percent of 16 is 8 that makes sense so it, since it is based on cost price we'll always consider cost price to be 100 percent right now this relation here which relates in terms of percent 
can you from here tell me what is selling price as a percent of cost price right so so selling price if you have to find knowing the markup percent how can you find it well 100 plus 50 is 150 percent right so it is as you can see you can add them up and you get 150 percent of cost price so let me write this cost price back right so all this is based on cost price so I'll be using this kind of table which not only relates the amounts when added but also percent when added right so that's the beauty of this table at times I can say 100% is let me rewrite here at times I may also use percent in terms of a whole number let's say one right 100% is one then 50% will be 0 0.5 and 150% will be 1.5 do you see that that also gives us the value of uh, 24 from 16 how let's do it so if I do 1.5 times 16 what do I get so 16 times 1.5 so you can use the calculator okay so we have 16 times 1.5 it gives you 24 correct so we can use decimal equivalent of fractions or decimal equivalent of percent to calculate selling price cost price markup and their relations correct so so at times we may extend this table to include uh, uh, percent but in decimals correct remember at present we have taken up an example where all these are based on cost price so i'm putting this cost price in brackets correct so this i hope gives you some idea of what we are getting into so in this video what have we learned we have learned that cost is increased by some amount to sell an item that amount by which the cost is increased is termed as markup by manufacturers retailers and business people in general now you can always find this markup value by calculating the difference between selling and cost price at times we are also interested in calculating percent markups now percent markup is always based on cost price if not specified so percent markup is markup divided by the cost price times 100 as an example we have taken an, an item whose cost is 16 dollars and that item is being sold for 24 dollars markup is their difference which is 8 in percent 8 divided by 16 times 100 gives you percent markup on cost price which is 50 percent you can find the selling price from the markup percent also 100 percent plus 50 percent is 150 percent definitely more than the cost price and if you do 150 percent of the cost price which is 16 you do get 24 as the result right so that is an alternate way of calculating with this let's move on and take some word problems i'm anil kumar and i hope that helps to understand the concept on markup thank you and all the best